have of late, but wherefore I know not, lost all my mirth, forgone all exercises, and indeed it goes so heavily with my disposition that this goodly frame, the earth, seems to me a sterile promontory. This excellent canopy, the air, this majestic roof fretted with golden fire, why it it appears to be nothing to me other than a foul and pestilent congregation of vapors. What a piece of work is a man. How noble in reason, how infinite in faculties, in form and moving, how express and admirable in, in action, how like an angel in apprehension, how like a god, the, the beauty of the world and the paragon of animals. And yet, to me, what is this quintessence of dust? How weary, stale, flat, and unprofitable these se seems to me the uses of this world. Well, your teachers were sad to hear about your loss, but they all wish you the best. I spoke to Bob, I mean Mr. Rosen, when I called the school. It's wonderful that you've remained productive through this difficult time. You're showing real maturity, dedication, good self-control is so important. He was proud of all the work you did. Glad you're part of that club or group, the, um, the <coughs> Alliance for Free and Strange Students. Just the Alliance is pretty great. Well, you know, it's really good to be an ally, to help those who need your support. Good allies are the key to any battle. She drove too fast. <laughs> he told me about that. She always day. drove too fast. I have something of yours here to get back. I never gave you anything. You know right well you did. Take these again. For to the noble mind, rich gifts wax poor when givers prove unkind there. If I go to hell for anything, it will be because I broke up with my girlfriend in an email on Christmas Eve. It was all too much. Getting into the college, my first choice college, but knowing I wouldn't go, my grandfather dying in the house I grew up in, my parents, my friends sending me mixed messages. It was all too much. I could not keep it together. All girls feel pain and confusion. None can easily master the painful and complicated problems of this time. All are aware of the suffering of friends, of the pressures to be beautiful, and the dangers of being female. All are pressured to sacrifice their wholeness in order to be loved. Like Ophelia, all are in danger of drowning. 